वेलकम टू एच टू के इन्फोसिस एच टू के इन्फोसिस इज अ ई वेरीफाइड बिजनेस बेस्ड इन अटलांटा जॉर्जिया यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स वी प्रोवाइड हंड्रेड परसेंट जॉब ओरियंटेड इंस्ट्रक्टर लेड फेस टू फेस थ्रू लाइव ऑनलाइन सॉफ्टवेयर ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम्स इट ऑल्सो इंक्लूड्स एक्सेस टू क्लाउड टेस्ट लैब विद सॉफ्टवेयर टूल्स वी प्रोवाइड लाइव प्रोजेक्ट फॉर यू टू वर्क ऑन वी ऑल्सो प्रोवाइड असिस्टेंस विद मॉक इंटरव्यूज resume preparation and review and job placement assistance h2k infosys is trusted by so many students across the world h2k infosys provides world class services in it training with real time project work for corporates and individuals special it training for ms students in the united states software design development QA manual and automation performance testing and maintenance IT staff augmentation job placement assistance and tech support okay right ah uh, prasad one more question who will be the client here uh, who will be the client of the mobile device or the uh, or the carrier or who who will be the client here the customer who gives the yeah. so for example if you are taking this hpk infosys uh, draw is the client right he gave that application to you to test right draw is the client and if you have any doubts you can go back to him and then you can get the clarification on the requirement right yeah so so only he and the mobile uh, device uh, uh, so only both are involved uh, so he is the customer and uh, who is the uh, who is the one who is going to do the work the device uh, the samsung device or for example i'm asking uh, i missed it can you come again yeah for example um uh, uh, mr rao uh, is the client uh, is the customer here right who is the um, who is the one who is going to take that uh, and do the work who is going to do the project uh, is it uh, if it is a samsung device is, does it come under samsung or Over rice the OS or who is the one who will do it? See, that? if I'm a Rao, right? What I will do? I want to uh, like to. I want to come up with one app, right? Before putting that into stores, what I will do is I will make sure that my app is working with each and every device, right? So what I will do? I will give this to you. Please check this app in each and every device that it is working fine or not. Then what you will do, you will test this HPK infosys in all these devices, and you will see the inputs. And if any device is not working properly, your developer will fix the issue, and then only we will go to production. That is the challenges in your uh, mobile application. Fine. So, yes. uh, so anyone can take, uh, anyone can, whoever knows, knows to write the code, or any company, they can do that, and they can. Not yeah. devices. That's how it does. Go. Yeah, anyone can do. See, say for example, if you are having Samsung uh, device, you can do right. You can test this HP Infosys website, right? Anyone can do. Okay. Right? No need to contact your uh, Samsung uh, organization and all. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Now, right here, what I will is I will clearly mention what kind of devices I am targeting, and uh, what are all the versions for each and every device. and also display size this is the display size of your mobile what is the display size because right my business clearly mentioned please test the devices with all this uh, screen sizes so my business is uh, looking for the app needs to work on on all these uh, display so what i will do i will test my app in all these devices with this particular uh, screen size yeah it's to get for uh, iphone yeah i will give that link but i tried but it not it did not work for me right i will give that link no problem now what i will do i will write the test cases for my app and all now what i will do first thing is installation right i am not writing each and everything right i am writing like uh, only right main things because right no need to waste the time and all verify verify the user
varied by the user is able to download the app from see they will give some OTA web link they will provide right my web link is this is my web link verify I am able to download the expected result is download should be successful and my precondition is device is in portrait mode see don't see this uh, gram uh, what do you call it? grammatical mistakes and right just i'm writing the on a fly okay prasad it should be in the next column you are writing it in fly yeah that's what right i'm saying like uh, okay. right uh, right if any such kind of mistakes right just uh, ignore it oh wait uh, more because right uh, writing the test case is a kind of waste of time only right download should be successful now what i will do once my download successful right i will try to uh, what i can do is here itself right i can check some right verify the prasad what is that number http what is that number that is nothing but oda right uh, you join the first session yeah right you can download your applications in uh, many ways right that means right uh, you can download your applications in many ways so it is similar to ip address uh, um, yes yes okay. right if you observe here yeah. see if you you can install your applications from different locations when you join the organization so you have so many ways like you can install from your oda install from usb right you can transfer from infrared and bluetooth but most of the times when you are working with organization every time we will use oda and over the air only okay. so here they will provide some download url where you can write your uh, where you can download your application so if you write play store or usb uh, we don't need to mention or just play store or just download it from See, that means you can use any of the method that means let's say for example if i'm giving the bill you can uh, uh, what you can do you can connect your uh, usb with your uh, mobile and then you can keep that build inside the folder right what you can do is you can go through that session right uh, i mean first session and uh, second session now here right and one more thing right someone is asked like right the rtm and all rtm is not required here because i clearly mentioned that requirement id and test case id this this template itself rtm that means right here itself you can clearly say that each and every requirement is tracked with the test cases or not so you can use this test case template itself for your requirement traceability matrix no need to create one more traceability matrix document and all now i'm writing one more test case like verify the application logo application logo should be as expected can uh, this is manju uh, can i ask one question yeah 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 actually uh, if if you are test is there any testing for you know uh, if h2k is developing an app and then uh, we have to Uh, do a compatibility testing with like you know the providers also like AT and T is providing Verizon is also providing so yes, is there anything yes. right uh, I guess right you all uh, it looks like you also missed the previous session okay right, right? no no yeah. I was there but I know yeah network testing right uh, if you observe right I mean in the right we need to do lot of testing right here when you are doing your uh, wait let me show you right you can uh, remember this figure. right you can see one uh, i told you can remember this one see what i am doing i am checking yeah, each and okay. everything and also if i am going with that see what is here i am happening different types of plans provided by the service provider each and every okay so that's what i am saying right so if you want to do your mobile application testing and if you want to start your mobile application testing 
keep this as a reference like it's a ready made just take all the details simply apply on the application nothing else okay thank you click on logo right i'm writing the test cases display and if you are having any doubts right wherever right you can ask me if you have any way right uh, doubt and all you can ping me by the time this is very small let us right master prasad uh, yes. my question is like for opa uh, this is how we represent right http something in the numbers right. so for play store and usb uh, do we have, how do we represent just from usb or download it from um, yeah test you will to say that writing the test case right yeah 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 what i will do i will write like this right verify user able to install the app with usb right and if you want the steps also you can mention like this usb and here you can oh. yeah thank you okay so here right you can also write your steps saying that uh, connect device with usb right place the build in the download folder like you can write like oh echo is there okay fine so verify that splash screen that right? splash screen should uh, uh, should not display should not display more than i am trying to write all the test cases in a single uh, a single uh, sheet only but right what you can do is you can uh, write in a proper manner right i am done with that then what i will do once that uh, here i need to write the one more line verify user is able to install install it install the downloaded downloaded app installation should be successful yeah this is 3 seconds is right this is nothing but it's a universal universal like right what we will do is we will uh, make sure that uh, this screen is not to uh, right i mean you cannot see that screen beyond this 3 uh, seconds because it's a universal uh, universal time and all. this is now for all the devices wherever you are having this loading right everywhere this applicable right so download is done okay you can also check uh, uninstall also verify user is able to uninstall the app install the app right like this. so uninstallation is so we are done with that uh, flash screen right so next what we will do so what i am do this is i am done with my 
portrait mode if you want you can also right for your landscape mode same test cases see here right actually what will happen is when you are working with your uh, mobile application right same thing right but you will do lot of repetition n number of repetition right this is n number of uh, repetitions you will have but now you can also start writing your uh, functionality what do you mean by functionality is here yeah. h2k process home page is display okay now what i will do verify the home page home page should be properly allowed so many of our students have given testimonials on how our training programs are you will find them on kudzu.com and on our website h2kinfosys.com on our website h2kinfosys.com you will also find more detailed information on who we are the courses that we offer what each course covers also if you're interested in a demo program please register on our home page on the left hand side just give us more information about yourself and we will send you a link for a demo class the demo class is absolutely free experience our commitment by just attending an orientation workshop at no cost our team of faculty and advisors are here to guide you with the right information if you still have more questions please feel free to call us call us at 770 777 this is a united states number if you're calling from the uk call us at 020 337 One seven six one five. You can also email us at training at h two k infosys dot com or h two k infosys at gmail dot com. Thank you for watching our videos. We wish you a great career in information technology.